So my artistic vision is... Am I good if I sit up straight though? Yeah. <laughs> I need to recollect for the name. I, I'm a big fan of perspective, and I always aim to challenge people's perspective. Do something that's unique, and do something from a point of view that people really are not used to seeing things from. But I think for me, it's just showing people a different side of life. So growing up, uh, I had a friend who was a really good photographer, and I really, I saw his work, and I was really like, I was really, it sparked an interest in me. And you know, I got my first camera. It wasn't great. It was actually terrible. But it kind of started me going into it and I just kind of dipped and dabbed in it for a while. And I kind of lost touch with it for a couple years till after I actually started college was when I finally got back into it again. It's opened up like a whole new world for me basically. It's really allowed me to see the kind of person I am. Like creatively, it's really allowed me to push myself in so many different ways, which has been awesome. So my favorite kind of photography is definitely street fashion. I love having, I like being outside. I'm a big outdoors person, so street fashion is like ideal for me because I get to be outside, I get to be in, like an element. And one thing I love about shooting outside is you work with what you have. Compared to like studio photography where you kind of have the power to move things around and do whatever you want. You work with, you basically, the world just gives you what it has and you have to make something out of that. You're able to make such a great amount of impact with just an image. And that's something that I try not to take for granted. And so a couple, about a year ago, in my community college, um, I was, my teacher actually told me about a conference and an art competition. I had to create these images, and so I had this idea of taking a minority group or something like that, you know, and using these strobe lights that almost had a context of, you know, the American flag or cops in America taking African Americans and doing this kind of image with this long exposure image. And it was something I did and it ended up blowing up and it ended up like receiving so much recognition from different schools, different conferences, which was something I never expected. And so that really showed me how powerful the medium art is, but how powerful photography is because one photograph is able to really shape someone's mindset. I should have a camera just following me all the way. <laughs>